UEFA President Michel Platini has reiterated that he will not implement goal line technology in Europe, describing the FIFA initiative as a waste of money. The outspoken Frenchman, who has always been opposed to FIFA's goal line technology, is adamant that it would be better for the sport to stick with the fifth referee. The ongoing Club World Cup in Japan is testing two different systems of goal line technology. Platini, who is in town to sign a memorandum of understanding with the Asian Football Confederation, AFC, at the AFC house in Bukit Jalil, continues to stand firm in rejecting the new technology, calling it a waste of money. It's not a question of goal line technology. It's a question of technology. Where you could begin by the technology, when you stop by the technology. To put the goal line technology in our competition is 50 million euro in five years. I prefer to give 50 million euro in, uh, in, the, in the grassroots, in development of the football, than to put 50 million in the technology for perhaps one or two goals by year. It's a lot of goal, eh? it's a lot of money for the club. And uh, we, uh, we supported, you know, uh, we supported the additional referees that now is, uh, is uh, 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 accepted by the international board. And uh, with, uh, with the referee who is at one meter for the line, I think if he has good glasses, he can see if the ball is inside or not inside. While UEFA are unlikely to adopt goal line technology anytime soon, AFC acting president Zhang Jilong is more receptive towards the idea. Just follow with that after... Uh, the test during this uh, World Club uh, Championship in Tokyo, then we will get uh, further information whether this can be adopted by all the competition or not. Meanwhile, the MOU between UEFA and AFC will see both confederations working closely together in all aspects of football, from sharing technical expertise, competitions, marketing, improving refereeing standards and grassroots developments. Platini, who pointed out that the agreement was a global understanding, says that UEFA had much to learn from their Asian counterparts.